Hi friends, sorry for the late tutorial video, so let's get started. Today I'm going to show you how to create this amazing sword shake. This video is sponsored by by 40 dig file repair. You can download this from the description. It's a really amazing tool. You will have a lot of AI tools here and repairing tool also. But we're going to use ability enhancer in this sponsor. So let's open it and import our video. I have this clip. Okay, once it's imported, I'm going to enhance it. We have few AI models, but I'm going to use the gen general model. Guys, can you guys can copy my setting just like this. After that, just click on enhance and it will start processing. As you can see, the quality is nice and crisp. Once it's completed, it will look something like this. Let me show you the full preview and after you can add my CC. I will leave this in the description. Okay, back to the video. Let's do your adjustment layer first and cut it according to me, just like this. After that, add the motion tile effect to prevent any black bar issues in the shake. After that, add the S shake effect from Sapphire. This one. And after that, just copy my steps. First, add a keyframe on the starting, which is zero, and go into the center of the effect and add a keyframe of three, just like this. After that, let's go at the end of the effect and again add zero on it. Okay, now these are our keyframes. As you can see, it gives us a little shake. Make sure to enable the motion blur. After that, select the keyframe and press S F9 to easy ease and copy my graph here, just like this. Just a simple graph, in and out, ease in and ease out, just like this. You can adjust it as well as you want. As you can see, it's give up a wobble shake, but after that, increase the frequency up to 5000. And this will give, our, give us a nice shake. Let me play it, as you can see. After that, add the effect called Lens BCC Lens OBS Blur. This, this one, Blur OBS. And uh, again, copy my steps. We need to add the keyframes. Set the sharper, and the center value will be 30. On the starting and the ending, we will add the zero keyframe here, and on the ending also zero. Press U to reveal the keyframes. Press F9 and change the graph. Just a little bit, not too much fast. Let me see. As you can see, it's give us uh, like a bouquet blur. Let me slow down it a little bit more. As you will see, it's give us a short shake. After that, let's add the exposure effect. You can also increase the frequency up to 10,000 if you want. I will add the exposure to 050. Just like this. Also, change the graph of the exposure. Just like me. You can see we, we have a nice glove. The pictures will also be available in the description. So don't worry. And thank you for watching. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you.